DuPage is among 12 counties declared disaster areas after intense rain and flooding ravaged many western suburbs recently. While Naperville wasn't hit as hard as other communities, the city still felt the effects of the devastating floods. We met one local family working to keep their home high and dry. The roar of the DuPage River going through the Faywell Dam. The river, or the water, actually came all the way up this back, back lot. Says it all for Glenn Gadiano and his family. Gadiano bought his house and the riverside property behind it in December of 2009. And when the weekend downfall began, he wasn't worried. My wife had mentioned that uh, there was sand in the cul-de-sac, and that was the first time I said, oh, wait a second, there's something, something's going on. While Naperville recorded just over three inches of rain at gauges in town, suburbs upstream got more than double that amount, causing DuPage County to partially open the dam and bring the rush of water to Naperville. We're very fortunate in the fact that the uh, water got within half an inch of going into Centennial Beach, but it did not uh, go up that extra half inch. Bill Novak's team provided the supplies for sandbags next to the Gadiano home on Riverview Drive and did their best to get out the word about the opening of the dam. We got out word as quick as we could. Um, the nice thing is every year that uh, things like this happen, we find better ways to communicate. And that's encouraging for Riverside homeowners like Gadiano who calls living next to the DuPage, putting up with five days of discomfort for 360 days of enjoyment. He says if the water would have come any closer to his property, he was ready to start sandbagging his backyard. He also knows one purchase he's making as soon as he can. I opted not to buy the flood insurance this year. I hope it's going to wait. Uh, I'm definitely going to get flood insurance now. Even though his home escaped damage this time, Gadiano is adamant he'll be ready the next time the DuPage River comes into his backyard. This is the highest the DuPage River has been in Naperville since the summer of 2008.